iOS 26 will finally allow you to set custom ringtones for your device. Well, we have been able to do this for years now, but we had to use a quite a difficult method using GarageBand and a lot of users would actually find that hard to do and just don't bother doing it at all. But now it is very easy for you to actually set any song that you want as a ringtone on your iPhone. It is actually very simple. All you have to do is have a file that's shorter than 30 seconds on the MP3 or M4A format. Once you have any of those, maybe on your voice recorder or even on your files app, then the job is done. All you have to do now is just set it as a ringtone. This is very simple. Let me show you how to do that. So you tap on the files app here. Here I have a couple of songs, under 30 seconds, MP3 format. All I have to do is just open it like this, tap the share button, and now what I can do is just tap use as ringtone. Once I've done that, it will take me to my settings app and there I have it. I can go ahead and use now this song as a ringtone for my device. How easy is that? Well, of course, a lot of songs, basically all of them, will be over 30 seconds long. But what you can do here is just download a simple app from the App Store that will allow it to cut a song. Like this, this right here, Music Cutter. I can just go ahead and use this and just load any song that I want from the Files app here. Tap the three dots right here, tap on edit, and then I can just go ahead and cut the song right here. Once I'm done with that, I can tap the save button and it will be saved right here on the app. Once it's saved, all I have to do now is just go ahead and save it to the files app. And from there, then I can go ahead and just set it as a ringtone. It is as easy as that. So that's basically it for this video, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed the video and found it helpful. You can finally set a ringtone on iOS. 26 that's really great again thank you for watching leave a like and subscribe for more and i'll see you on the next one